Hi there, I'm Chris Berman. Up next on ESPN, very good football weather for this one. Just a hint of a breeze out of the stadium. But all in all, you won't find a much better autumn day for football. Bengals, Eagles. Next! The fans are finding their way to their seats, uh, those who really own those seats, as we get set to begin this exciting game. Hi folks, I'm Dan Steele, and welcome to Lincoln Financial Field. Peter O'Keefe is at my side, as usual, and Peter, this contest should not be... Tales of it. Elliott kicking off for the Eagles. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Elliott kicks it off to begin the game. Tate catches it back at the two. Stop at the 30. Tate was able to find some weak spots in the defense. Got a good run back off that kick. The Bengals send their offense out on the field and will start this drive at their own 30-yard line. Boyd makes the catch on the right sideline and picks up four on the play. Boyd had nobody on him. The quarterback saw it and got the ball to him. He moved the ball and it will be second down. Eagles, Bengals, yeah. Makes up a couple. I haven't done these two teams yet, and the Eagles, I'm going to be the Eagles. They're probably, you know, a lot of people don't want to hear this. It might be the worst team in the league this year. Third down, four yards to go. Oh, Joe Burrow on the pick. Makes a play on this one and forces the incompletion. Fourth down coming up. Number 10 lines up to punt after the three and out. Number 10 takes the snap and punts it away. Number 13 gets it at the 26. One man to beat, no one in front of him. Oh! And touchdown! I haven't had one of those in forever. I had a kickoff return for a touchdown, but a punt. I haven't had one of those in a long time. Hey, what didn't go right on this punt return? Watch this. Got the right blocking, got the right read, got the right moves. It's all right on. All the way to the end zone, baby. It's all about teamwork, and that was a perfect example. Special teams. Haunting the Bengals. <laughs> the extra point and extra it's point good. good there's the signal and we're ready Elliot kicks this one away Tate fields the kickoff at the eight shoots bang down at the 30 Tate received that nice kick and a nice little First run back ten. after the catch good job the Bengals stalled early last drive, and we'll have to wait and see what happens here. They'll start at their own 30-yard line. Number 34 gets the handoff and picks up a couple. Second and seven. Ball at the Bengals. Four receivers line up as the defense settles into a nickel package. Number 34 gets the call. Oh shit! He's and gone. Takes it upfield. Nice run. 20. 10, touchdown. Nice run. Yeah. Dude, he just ran over my safety. Close to his blockers here. And it pays off. Peter, that will put a touchdown in his stat column. And that's always nice to have, Dan. So far, he's got 72 yards and one touchdown. I mean, I'm, four to attempt I'm the probably going to lose this game to the Bengals just because. Or it'll be close because the Eagles are that bad. The extra point is good. It's good. 
The ref gets the signal, and we're set. They might not be this Number bad four, in real life, but they're kind of based off the ratings. They're, they're the Number worst 82 team. decides to take it out of the end zone. Tackled at the 26. Number 82 took it out of the end zone, and while it may have been a little risky, he gets out close to the 20, so it all comes out in the wash on that play. The Eagles offense takes the field, and they will start at their own 26-yard line. Oh. Evans tips That's it away incomplete. on the coverage, incomplete. With the Evans couldn't have read that play any better if it was tattooed on the inside Second of his ten. helmet. That had potential for some yards, Peter, but the defense was on top of it and shut it down. Good denial there. Second down coming up. Number seven goes into the left sideline and it's good for a gain of eight. Number seven rolled the dice by targeting the receiver with two defenders near him. Let the pass click and they'll move the ball. A great job to move the ball and get themselves into a third and short situation. This is a critical play for this drive. Yeah, now Dan, they can just go forward and make the play. Sounds easy, Peter, but we'll see if they can pull it off. Ward catches it in the flat and they convert on third down. Ward had a man playing him close back there, but he made a great move to get the catch. A nice play and with only a short distance to the first, they put it together and make it happen. Yeah, third and short always looks easy, but it's not, Dan. That's good execution. Sanders picks we'll up try this Philly option screen here. Up second down. Second down with the tight end right. Well, they didn't fall for that. Loses yards on that one. Number 28, not only cleaned the ball carrier's clock in the backfield, but buffed and polished oh, it, too. They have a weird Big playbook, too. They don't have any That's his second tackle freaking so far. Uh, um, shotgun plays. So Third stupid. There's a few teams that are like this. Number seven throws a header and is caught at the 47. Number seven brings this one perfectly. Great pass, great catch, great play. Let's have this. Oh my God, Flacco. Touchdown at the 33. Dude, I had to run because they split like blow to the ball carrier the, the, there. The lineman went all wide. The like, oh, fumble. I can pick this up. Great hard yep, play. that's Flacco. Here, there are many ways Mental note: never run with Flacco but, again. Uh, a turnover is not one of them. No, definitely not. That was a big time play. The Bengals want to capitalize on the fumble and will start this drive at their. Th you know what? Flacco gets benched for that. 33 yard line. Tate goes in motion. Number nine. Rifles it out. I don't know why they even have Flacco. Incomplete. Flacco playing in the game. It hurts. Play any better if it was tattooed on the inside of his helmet. Ball at the Bengals. 33 yard line. No dice and it falls incomplete. Boyd had some room on the fringes there, but couldn't reel in the pass. That would have gotten the first, but it's incomplete, and it will be third down. Oh, let's watch this. Five wide out versus a D that is wisely loaded up on DBs. Number nine puts his ear into this Bengals. one, and... Dang, nice throw. Higgins faces double coverage on this play, but still comes out with the ball. Nice throw and nice catch. Let's take a look. They had him covered well, but he was still able to make the catch. He has a great receiver. First down, two tight ends in the game. Number 34 goes in motion. They get it back. Henry touches him. 71 recovered the ball, but this is yeah, a we'll, we'll terrible see. play for the offense. They get it back there, but <laughs> that's oh, that just dumb luck. Offensive lineman did a hell of a job. Okay, Dan, what we're going to look for here is whether his arm is moving forward Dude, or that's not. not. That's going to tell us if it's considered a pass. I don't know, Dan. It doesn't look like it's moving forward After to me. I agree stands, with the original the call of fumble. The passer's arm was not moving forward. Therefore, it was a fumble. 
Cincinnati will be charged a timeout. Second down. That will cost them a timeout. And you have to believe that he is not very happy with that call. Second and 21. Number nine on court this to the left side or a nineteen yard gain of twenty on the twenty yard pass play. Number nine, right at the ball back there to his man, right past all that traffic. Good job. Huge pickup, and the first down is now within striking distance. Boy, that's exactly what they needed if they wanted to keep this drive alive. Big play. Right to our Peter. Let's see if they can convert. Higgins goes in motion. Oh, oh, oh. The 43. It'll be fourth down. There we go. Number 10 gets ready to punt this away. And that'll do it for quarter number one. And we're all tied. You think so? Higgins Chase can be lethal. Fourth down, and the punting unit is on the field. All right, my best part of my team's coming up, special team. Let's see if I can get another kick return for a touchdown. Punts it away. Number thirteen fields the punt at the fourteen. Crosses the uh -oh. field. Uh oh. Uh oh. Breaks a tackle. Runs out at the thirty-two. Number 13 takes this eyesore of a punt, and he makes it worse with a huge run. Two big failures by this kicking team. First on the kick, and then on the return. I ran about 40 yards a game 10. The Eagles fumbled the ball away last time. Let's see if they can hold on to it as they start this drive at their 32-yard line. Man, I should have thrown that earlier. Hubbard gets to his man in the backfield for a big loss. I don't know what happened to the protection. Let's have a look. You know, D Dan, it's all about focus and persistence. He was not going to let that quarterback get that pass off. The defensive design worked flawlessly, and the refs will spot the ball well behind the original line of scrimmage. What a way to derail a series from the onset. Second and long ahead. Number 86 plays this one perfectly, getting himself to the right. First down, two receivers to the left. Yeah, both both of the old lines stink. Number 86 tutors his man on the finer points of coverage on this play. A nice catch, but also a nice move to shake the coverage. He owned that matchup. A nice run after making the grab, and that's a big plus coming from your tight end. Especially for him. He's not known for making those big gallons Go right like back that. to him. It's going to be the Ertz show. Throws this one over the middle, and it's cut for the score. They keep running dumb defense like that with no safety over the top. I keep throwing it up to Ertz. Number one, doesn't leave much room for error on this one. It's either a great pass and completion or an interception. Let's take a look. Well, that's a great catch and a great completion. You don't see many quarterbacks thrown into double coverage like that. Yeah, succeed. player of the game already just on that on drive that alone. Touchdown, Peter, and they have to be happy with their performance on that drive. Yeah, great calls and great execution. It's good. Man, get tired already tonight. There's the signal, and we're ready. Elliott kicks it off. Number one fields it all the way back at the eight. The ball's loose. The back is How did my guy not get that? 24. Face mask, number 21, kicking team. 15-yard penalty. On the, the kickoff the team. First down. <sighs> that sucks. The Bengals bring their Cincinnati. offense on the field and will start this drive at their 45-yard line. 
number 34. Number gains three, five four. on the play, the and carrier. that brings up second down. With the tech. <laughs> Second Look at the four. yards after the first hit. That's how you fight yards. for every inch of turf. Number nine moves this one to the flat, and this one is incomplete. Higgins marked an almost guaranteed catch there, and as a receiver, you have to carry your weight and make the play. They don't come much more catchable than that one. That's his first drop of the game, and yeah, the Bengals are pretty crashed in here too. You can't throw too much blame on him for that. That would have been a tough catch. Number 34, chews up four yards, and that brings up fourth down. And they're punting. Made the save, dropping the ball carrier before he could get to the markers. They let the ball move close to the first, but they could not let it pass. That's a great job holding them back, man. Fourth and short. Number 10 gets the snap and punts it away. Number 13 catches it at the 15. One man to beat. I like their returner. Out at the 41. Number 13 had a huge run back, so big that he basically wiped out all the yardage from that small fry punt. He almost broke that. The Eagles are looking for some separation before half, and will start this drive at their 41 yard line. He's going the wrong way. Oh, I tried to throw it away. I wanted to throw it to Ertz. Hubbard makes Hurts a great play here. He runs it. That Second sucks. down, three wideouts in the game. Ball for the Eagles, 22 yards. Number one lets it go. Hurts third. Oh, he dropped it. From the receiver, incomplete. Number, Number one, threw that ball to a receiver who had two guys on him. He's probably fortunate it was just an incomplete pass at that point. That would have been a big play and a big first down, Peter. They just don't sync up. Good call. Maybe next time it'll work. Bell let his man get some yards on the play, but then he stopped him. Let's check it out. Hurts to Hurts keeps eight, working. Lines up for the punt formation. Take to make the return. Oh, I try to get that off before the two-minute warning. Number eight lines up to punt after the three and out. Number eight takes the long snap and punts what it a away. Terrible punt. Tate fields the punt at the 22. Brought down at play. the 26. Tate fielded the ball, and although he was dropped pretty quickly, that terrible kick Cincinnati. gives him some good field position. The Bengals offense comes out and has an opportunity to tie it before halftime. They'll start at the and they love that rollout 26 play. Six yard line. Boyd snaps um, the dart right. Yeah, I'll probably go to a few Browns games this year. I haven't decided which ones yet. First and 15. Ball at the Bengals, 21 yard line. Why do you want to know if I'm back? Gains five on the play, and that brings up second down. I'm actually not because I have I've I had COVID and I have antibodies on the, on the I'm, I have immunity right now. I'm sure the NFL will do something stupid. Oh my god, he's gone. The NFL will probably try to recover. We will try to try to require that people have vaccines to go to games or have separate. They'll do something stupid. I know NFL is dumb like that. Number 27 came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception. Actually, people that have had COVID, I know people don't want to hear this, but the people that have had COVID and have, have strong antibodies have higher resistance than the, um, than the vaccine. 
I don't want to talk about Azoka. YouTube will freaking ban me, so let's not talk about that sort of thing. I'm coming out. Off the pass, but moving the ball. The Eagles are going to yeah, but they can make your life miserable. They can make you not be able to do certain things. Their own 19 yard line. <laughs> Allen makes a play on this and forces the incompletion. Hey guys, they bought the pass. Second and 10. Ball at the Eagles, 19 yards. Yeah, hurts it pretty quick. Number one does a little last minute razzle dazzle here. And he gets it. First down, one man back. Take their first time up. They can't cover Ertz, and I'm just sending him straight down the field. Number one throws. Oh, there they did. The right side, and it's intercepted. Crosses the field, runs out of bounds. At Bates does a nice job picking off the pass there. He's got it, and he gets a little. The Bengals. No, I don't. I, I, I could care less the about the Olympics. Fifteen. Number thirty-four gets the on first down and shoots forward for nine yards. Number thirty-four played smart and used his blockers to perfection on that last play. Peter, what a nice pickup to get them into a second and short situation. Yeah, great play, and now they have a bunch of options on what to try next. Number nine. Number 89 is going to make a great play right here. Snags the football and then really turns on the... And that'll do it for the first That's half the of this of one. The, the Eagles point. are out in front, 14-7. to 7. And now let's send you to Chris Berman in our studios in Bristol for the ESPN Halftime Report. Boomer? I've seen some of the highlights of it, but I really don't care about the Olympics all that much. All right, Dan, we'll get back to you in a bit. But welcome, everybody, to the ESPN Halftime Show. I'm Chris Berman. Now we'll look at our first half by the numbers, and I'll tell you, first downs have been the story here. The Eagles should be way ahead on the scoreboard, but somehow they've let their opponent hang with them. Let's see if they can change things in the second half. Let's get started in this one early in the first quarter. Number 13 would field the punt, make that all-important first man miss, then things opened up in front of them. Touchdown for the Eagles. The Eagles strike first and go up by seven. The Bengals still early in the first. That's been an all right game. 31. Number 34 gets the handoff as they keep it on the ground here. He's got room up the middle. A 68-yard touchdown for the Bengals. Eagles towards the end of the first quarter. Game tied, seven all. Allen would turn things around. Big shift in momentum here as he pounced on a fumble. The defense recovered. The Bengals still late in the first. Number nine would drop back and deliver a strike on this one. Game tied, seven all. Number one is back to throw this time. He's gonna look for his big old tight end. He finds him for a big gain here. A 38 yard play that set up an Eagle touchdown. Eagles midway through the second. The ball at their own 21. Number one connected with his man on this one. The Bengals late into the second quarter. Bengals trailing by seven. Number one came up with a huge play here as they cover a lot of real estate on this one. Eagles creeping up on the end of the half. Number 86 makes him pay. He's running a deep route and this ball is right where it needs to be. Eagles winning 14 to seven. Number 89 had to work to find an opening but he was able to haul this one in. And that's where we'll leave this one. Eagles are holding on to a lead. No, oh, we played to down seven. to him last year. And we barely won one of the games. Today's halftime hero has turned in an incredible performance thus far. Number 86 has played outstanding. And now let's return to the second half with Dan Stevens and Peter O'Keefe. 
Thanks, Boomer, and welcome back to our broadcast. The Bengals aren't going to be that bad this year, though. They're not going to be an easy. It's not going to be an easy game. Designed and developed for anybody. in collaboration with Dolby, the leader in surround sound technology. The Eagles Number will four. receive Picking to start the, the second half. And unless like Joe Burrow is not the same, but if he plays as good as he did before his knee injury, um, they'll be really good. But if he's like hesitant because of that knee, it might be a different story. The 31. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. How they turn the ball over leaps out at me. And you have to think. Yeah, we had no wide receivers. Them, turnovers are the most telling stat in the NFL. They are like those stats. Great so what do we do? Of course, we, we, we chucked it all over the field. We didn't run the ball that much. Way back at the 20. Number 96 had the quarterback cornered way back downfield there, and he sacked him for a major loss of yards. That'll be his first sack of the game. Number 86 passes it over the middle, and gets past the markers for a first down. Sanders gets the handoff and runs into traffic. Crosses the field. Number one has to resort to plan B on this play. That's why he gets the big box then. I'm abusing Ertz. Number 86. Hurts to Ertz. One with the pass coverage, and the ball is waiting for him downfield. That's a great catch. It's all about being in the right place at the right time, Dan. Perfect execution. Yet another high roller of a completion for him, and you have to wonder, can he be stopped? Well, doesn't look that way, Dan. Number one zings it to the right side, and he now I'm just forced to do it because it's funny. Number 86, the bomb triple coverage and came away with a phenomenal catch. The balls are coming his way in the middle, and he's making them pay. You have to like his performance so far. Well, Dan, I like any receiver who's willing to go over the middle and sacrifice the body to make the catch. Number 86 catches at left sideline, and he's got the first down. Number one gets it past the defender and into the arms of his receiver. That's a great play. Check it out. Ooh, nice accurate throw. What a pass, and he is generating some great numbers. Oh, absolutely, Dan. So far, he's got 209 yards and one touchdown. Oh, I the tried to throw it to Hurts. No. Oh, my God. This guy's going to return it. Hurts with the tackle. Like, uh, yeah, we've had an injury down on the field. As soon as we hear anything, we'll be sure to pass the no. along to you. Let me see the replay of that. I don't want to hit the button because I want to see the replay. They're not going to show me the replay. and Oh, and it'll only go back that far. I want to see if his arm was going forward. The Bengals have an extremely short field ahead of them as they will start this drive at the nine-yard line. Higgins goes in motion. Number 34 loses two, and that will bring up second down. Just think, even Ertz made the um, touchdown saving tackle there. Back there. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. They put a stop to this play behind the line of scrimmage. Pretty good call by the defensive coordinator. Agreed, Dan. They landed all locked up. There. That will bring up second down. Number nine throws a heater right sideline, and it falls incomplete. <laughs> What's up? A vintage wrestling. Yep, do them both. That will bring up fourth and goal. Look at that. Ertz with held him to a field goal because of his hustle. Might have been the play of the game right there. Forces an incompletion. 
That was a good call by the defensive coordinator. Oh, it sure was. Perfect D for that situation. And it will bring up fourth down. It's good. Number four puts in an easy short one. A clean kick, no worries. Uh, the Chiefs are still favorite. Number four, kicking off for the Bengals. There's the signal, and we're ready. Browns can play with the Chiefs, though. What's up, D.I. Skills? Boom's a beauty here. Let's get not these two teams. Number 13 decides to take it out of the end zone. Breaks free. Number 13 took it out of the end zone, and while it may have been a little risky, he gets out close to the 20, so it all comes out in the wash on that play. The Eagles' offense has stalled late in their drives the past few times down. We'll see if they can finally score. You're missing the, the Hurts to Hurts. <laughs> yeah, Hurts to Hurts connection. Number 86 makes the catch, but watch Wait till you see this pass. I'm, I'm completely forcing it to the tight end all the time. For more yards. You can't coach that. Beautiful catch, Peter, and his stats are moving up. Moving way up, Dan. He's now got 218 yards on 10 catches. Oh, wow. Look at the yardage racked up through the air. Number 86 catches this one, and he's just barely past the markers for a first. Number 86 goes to the outside here and picks up some good yardage. It's worth a second look. Hurts nice to Hurts. Past the marker and out of bounds. That's a great play. First down, 10 yards to go. Yeah, I, I know. Um, I appreciate the details in this, too. Number one, fires this one over the middle, and the reception's made at the 38. Brought down hard at the 28. That will bring up first down. Number 86 took his lone defender to school on that last play, making the catch with relative ease. A nice run after making the grab, and that's a big plus coming from your tight end. Especially for him. He's not known for making those big gallops like that. Oh, I should have thrown it, but we'll just, we'll just pick up the first with Hurt. At the 16, first down. Number one. No one to throw to, so he just tucked it under. I could have probably threw it. It's worth it hurts, but if it wasn't for that I don't know why I was kind of afraid. Thought that safety might come get it. Number one throws this and it's caught at the one. That probably should have been picked right off. There. But Ertz is unstoppable. Number thirty seven. Defense. Half the distance to the goal, automatic first down. Can I put, can I put Ertz in at running back and hand it off to him? We got to try to get it to Ertz. There he is. He, he's on stop. He's on fire. He's in Fuego right now. This catch here. Great job of Can't stop him. You can only hope to contain him. You, by the way, this is kind of cool. Watch how uh, Jalen Hurts throws this. He sidearmed this. This is like Bernie Kozar throw here. Look at that. Slow it down. A little sidearm action. Another little detail about this game a lot of people don't notice. Vintage, we'll see if we get it here. I'll show you. You probably know this, though. Oh, I got a normal, I got a normal uh, snap there. A lot of people don't realize, like, snaps, they can be high, outside, inside, um, like, low, and uh, it affects the kicks. Oh, the field goal the Snaps are... This one away. Yeah, Madden can't really. No, every Number snap one, is perfect on Madden. The kickoff at the eight. The ball's loose. The uh oh, not the going ball. good for the Bengals right now. You know what time it is. It is Earth's time. The Eagles offense takes the field and they are already in field goal position. No, oh, he They'll dropped it. At the 26 yard line. Number one, Number rifles it out left side, receiver. and it's knocked away from the receiver, no, incomplete. The 
number 86. Texas the heater left sideline and number one has little problem. And that'll do it for the third the quarter. The, the Eagles quarter. enjoying the lead 21 to 10. I didn't make these rosters, so it's probably it's probably a bad. Whoever the returner is probably not supposed to be there. This one right oh, 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 almost got incomplete. him. Incomplete. Number 28. Number 28. <laughs> Couldn't have read that play any better if it was tattooed on the inside of his helmet. That had potential for some yards, oh, Peter, oh, but the defense was on top of it and shut it down. Good denial there. Second down coming up. Number 86 makes the catch out to the This guy's all world. That's a touchdown. Suiters his man on the finer points of coverage on this play. A nice catch, but also a nice move to shake the coverage. The man, the Bengals match. defense is not Another good. Big play, and who else would it be? He's been all over the field today. All over and all over the end zone. This guy is a scorer. It's the good. Point is good. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Elliott kicks it off. Tate catches it back at the nine. Tackled at the 31. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. Well, the turnover column has the grim news, in my opinion. If you want to win, you have to hold on to the ball. Man, this was a close game, like, a few minutes ago. Start this drive. At the 31 yard line. Number nine throws a high, long one to the right, and it's off incomplete. Number 27 with the coverage. Down! Number 41 gives it away on the coverage incomplete. Throws up bullet here, and they can't connect. Incomplete. Higgins looked like he was all over that one, but it just got away somehow. Tough incompletion. Peter, I tell you, he, he seems to be in a bit of a funk recently. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, that's his fourth ball thrown his way. Oh, I thought I was going to pick that. They didn't have to. They turned it over on downs. The 24 gets no a fumble there. One. Right there. That's how you play D. They don't convert on fourth down, Peter. Pretty much squelching any hopes of a fourth quarter comeback. Yeah, they Who should I throw it to? Field goal off that one. Let's just say throw comeback to Earth. is going to be very difficult. The Eagles offense takes the field. And can they capitalize on the defensive stop? What's up? Well, they'll Please start go. this drive at the 30-yard line. New. Number one throws a bullet to the flat. And the catch is made for a gain of a couple. Number one, oh, a perfect pass back there. You know, I had a better shot at it than the defense did, and hey, I'm up here in the booth. Not much there. It'll be second down. Got to take what you can get, Dan, but they were, you know, hoping for more. Third down, two receivers to the left. Number one, zings it to the right side, and they get the first Number 86, has some company on this play, but he still makes the catch. That's good concentration and focus. It's worth another look. Oh, maybe they should have triple covered him there. I'm glad he finally nabbed one because he's had a string of missed catches before this. Yeah, his quarterback obviously didn't lose faith in him, though, Dan, because he's kept throwing it his way. Number 86. Oh, bad throw. Didn't haul that one in, that and it the rare miss to Earth. Wilson did a tremendous job on that Wilson last play. The guarding against the post pattern. That pass went incomplete. That had potential for some yards, Peter, but the defense was on top of it and shut it down. Good denial there. Second down coming up. <laughs> Number one fires this one over the middle. And I don't know why I get a kick out of just forcing it to Ertz every play. The Bengals are so bad on defense. 
Number 86 has just one guy on him, and he beats him easily. Even with my few extra pounds, I, I think I could have done a better job covering him. <laughs> <laughs> I doubt that. He would have Same thing, this like was a, a close game until I started forcing yeah, it to Earth. pretty good. They score again, and they are starting to pull away here. The yes, they are, Dan. Good. They've got a nice pad now. If they stay focused, this game is theirs. There's the signal, and we're ready. Elliot kicks it off. Tate fields the Thanks, Alex. At the two. Dodges attack. I just, you know what? I just play stuff I like. I like football games, so I play a lot of football games. I play other stuff too. All right, man. Cool. Is this the hall on the Hall of Fame? You know what? He probably broke some kind of record. We'll see what happens as they start this drive at their own 28-yard line. How do you drop that? Number 24 That's makes a play on this and forces the incompletion. Number 24 managed to disrupt things. Second he got in there and he smacked that pass. I'll do a Madden team. stream when it comes Another out. Another batted ball, and they have been attacking the pass every chance they get. That's right, Dan. You know, why simply throw the pass when you've been obliterated? Number 9 throws a heater right side I know how to upload craft class files like uh, three. No, play. I don't, Alex. I'm sorry. Number 41 makes a play on this and forces the incompletion. Fourth down coming up. Number nine throws a big high lob and it falls incomplete. They will. Harris puts a stop to this pass play. He does a great job of covering his man and tips the ball incomplete. Check it out. Oh, yeah, it's all about breaking up the pass, and that's exactly what he did. They don't get the fourth down conversion they needed. We're going to run the ball here. We're going to waste some time. No, that far behind, they are definitely in go for broke mode. Unfortunately, they got broke. Scott carries it past scrimmage and searches for a hole. All right, back to Earth. Played smart and used his blockers to perfection on that last play. And boy, Peter, I figure they had him dead to rights that time, but he found a way to get free. Oh, I had to wait too long for him to get open. In the league, Dan. That won't happen often. All right, back to Earth. Got the sack, but he was totally unblocked. You need to at least lay a hand on someone to slow him down a bit. Peter, he's really gotten after the quarterback in this game. Oh, he could say that again. 20 so catches far, with the single player. Two tackles two sacks. Number 86 catches the bullet out left, and they get the first. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, look, 20 receptions, and now he's tied the record. This is a game to got to go for the record now. Scott has his number called on first down and oh, bad throw. We got a flag though. Ten yard penalty from the spot of the foul. Just Justin more room for Ertz to work. Man back there, offensive holding was the right call. First and twenty. Ball at the thirty-one. I couldn't. For some reason, it wouldn't throw the ball. I don't know what happened. No. 65 did a great job back there by not only getting the sack, but getting him way back. Oh, my God. Loss. That was weird. Will be two losses in a row. Great reads by the D on the last two plays, Dan. I got to break this record. Down. The clock is stopped at two minutes. Number one. Rifles this no. One over the middle and it's bobbled and dropped. Incomplete. All right. Number 86. Looked like he had All right, we got, we got to just do an easy one. Just break the record. That's his first drop of the game. And while every drop does hurt, you can't throw too much blame on him for that. That would have been a tough catch. Third down. Both tight ends left. Check. Gray. 44. Check. Gray. 44. Oh, I got bad it down. All right. down at the line fourth down I'm going fourth for down. this just to get him the Hubbard the, the catch away right at the line that is their fourth batted ball unbelievable you, we've seen a number right. of good defensive plays fourth from this squad we sure have ball. we'll see if they can keep it up <laughs> could get it off the sack and that will force a turnover on no it's like the Number game didn't want me to break the record. Sack, but he was totally unblocked. 
You need to at least the one time I, I couldn't even throw the ball, I was hitting it. Oh, no. All right, we got to stop him here. We got to get the ball back. Shouldn't they have just punted? Well, it's not only greedy to go for it with that kind of a lead. It's just plain stupid. Reckless play calling. I don't even care if they score. I'm going to let them score. near midfield with the clock at 149. All right, we're letting them score just so we can get the ball back and get Ertz the record. Tate is going to make the catch. Right there, but that number four to attempt the extra point. Allen holding. Watch him get the onside or some stupid stuff. Now the point after the extra point is good. It's good. They're setting up for the onside kick. Number four bounces it up. Scott gathers it up at the 37. Thank God. Scott is quick to react when the onside kick comes bouncing his way. Watch him move. And get the football before the kicking team has a shot. It's all about reflexes. A gutsy call. And when you live high stakes. All right, this should be a nice, easy reception here. Well, they lost. And now we'll see how they recover. Number one throws this on a rope. What is going on? The game doesn't want me to get the record. He's cheating. He just dropped it. That's his second drop. And he cannot be happy with that. Sometimes the ball bounces your way. And sometimes it doesn't. Exactly. Second down, tight end to the left. There it is, history. The Bengals take their first time out. Third and 21 receptions, and he's got it. He's got the record for the most catches in a single game. Wow. Number one unloads this one. Oh, well, I got the record. That's all that matters. We got the record. I was trying to get him another touchdown, but oh well. is a nice interception. I should put a little more air under that. That was my fault. Got it. I threw it. I bulleted it instead of putting a little air under it. Done his part. And then some. So far, he's got two interceptions. The Bengals will start this drive deep in their own territory with the clock at 124. Tate uh oh, the what is going on? He's gone. 25, 30, 20, 10. He's in Bengals. for the touchdown. Tate is going to make a great play right here. Snags the football and then really turns. Number four to attempt the extra point. This is the defensive struggle, and I mean the defenses are struggling. Here's the extra point. He missed the extra somehow point. he misses it. What in the world? Oh, you don't see this much. And if you did, there would be a lot of kickers looking for work. Watch this. Whip. No good. That is embarrassing. They're setting up for the onside kick. Number four bounces it up. Jackson gets it off the bounce. And Jackson is going to let a miracle happen on this onside. It comes his way and then... All right, Ertz has a record. I'm not gonna force it to him anymore. We're gonna we're gonna get the heck out of this crazy game. They're calling timeouts. Second down, three wideouts in the game. Eighty-six. The Bengals take a timeout. That's their final one. Third and oh, those are impressive stats there, especially from a tight end. Number one throws a high and long one to the right, and the catch is made for the first. The clock continues to tick down. He's all world now. First down, one man back. Scott will get the carry on first down and runs into Oh, he was open. I could get it off. And the clock will continue to run. 
Number 28 did a great job Flaker back there again. by not only getting the sack, but getting him way back for a huge loss. Another sack Second by this defensive squad, and they have All generated, well, some very shocking numbers so far. I don't know about shocking, but turf feeding, yes. Number one passes this one, and it's caught. He got knocked into the end zone. Oh, my God. Number one throws right past the coverage and into his receiver's hands. Nice throw. That touchdown will seal it, Peter. Well, barring some type of miracle, they are going to come away with this one. He's up over five TDs and proven to be unstoppable. What a player. Wouldn't it be funny if they picked Jalen Hurts as a player of the game instead of uh, Hurts? It's got to be Hurts, right? the signal and we're set Elliot kicks this one away Tate fields it all the way back at the 10 Brought down at the 31 Tate got a very respectable return off that nice I wonder if that's there, still Dale. the record um, for catches in the game 20 from T.O. The Bengals start this drive of the game for that's pretty amazing to have 20 catches and the clock at 18 <laughs> I mean, I had to force on this it. One. Incomplete. Incomplete. With How do you get 20 catches, too? Don't they start double teaming you? Second down. The Second clock is stopped at 14. Ball at the Bengals, 31 yard line. Number nine lofts this one out to the left, and it's knocked away from the receiver. Incomplete. That ball ain't going nowhere. Third down. I have to look that up or. They did. They gave me some kind of crib stuff. Number 24. Or it, it said you got. You unlock some stuff in the crib. Number 24 came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. Another bad or extra VIP credits, whatever they give you. Every chance they get. Why simply defend the pass when you can obliterate? Number nine zips it to the left sideline. I think I got a thousand crib credits for this game. That's a lot more than you normally get. So I got a lot of credit. It's for tonight's game. beating that Eagles record. Come out on top, 42 to 23. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens. Oh, we got to see the highlights. Let's see time. what uh, Boomer says in the highlights. Man, I can't stop yawning. him. Sorry. All right, gang, great work as always. And with that, we welcome everybody back to the ESPN studios for our ESPN video games post-game show. I'm Chris Berman. The Eagles stepped it up for sure, putting up some good numbers. We'll pick up the action midway through the third quarter. Daniels going to have a beat on this one. It's a This was Ertz He's saving right the um, touchdown. After driving two yards on three plays, number four would come on and connect on the field goal try. Connect on the field goal. The Eagles trying to answer back. Eagles ahead by four. Number one would find his target on this one. They move ahead by 11. The Eagles have it again. Number one connected with his man on this one. A 10 yard touchdown for the Eagles. Eagles out in front, 28 to 10. Number one would drop back and deliver a strike on this one. A 14-yard touchdown for the Eagles. The Eagles have opened it up and now lead by 25. The Eagles have to stop on fourth down, this time at the 37-yard line. Number one would find his target on this one. The Bengals have to stop on fourth down. Bengals down by 25. Tate came up with a big play as he was able to pull this one in. They narrow the gap a bit and they're now down by 18. The Eagles on defense. Bates is reading the quarterback's eyes all the way as he's able to get his hands on this one and pick it off. Eagles up 35 to 17. Tate was definitely a key as he was able to work his way open for a big one here. An 84 yard touchdown for the Bengals. The Bengals close the gap some. They're down by 12. 
the Eagles answering right back. The Eagles inside the red zone. Number one would find his target on this one. An 18-yard touchdown for the Eagles. And that's where we'll leave this one. Eagles win this one, 42-23. to Now let's take a moment to speak to our player of the game. Number 86 is on hand with Susie Culver. Susie? Thank you, Chris. You really came up big, and you prevailed with a big victory. What gave you guys the edge uh, today? Almost 400 yards, to give a lot of credit 25, to the five line. TDs. You know, the offense starts out with the foundation, and that's the offensive line. Those guys often get overlooked, and they bring it every game. I think their hustle was a big part a of day. us coming out on top today. Back to you, Chris. That concludes our presentation of the NFL preseason on ESPN. Celebrating its 25th anniversary as the worldwide leader in sports. I'm Chris Berman. See you next time. All right. I'm going to have to go do my crib before too long. I haven't done that yet. Not going to do it now, but um, I got to mess with it. I got to buy stuff for it. I gotta buy stuff for here. We're gonna we'll deck it all out. Let's go. Let's go up and check the trophy room at least. There was one trophy I got in that last game. There's another trophy. That's cool. I like all the trophies you can get. All right, that's about all I got, guys. I got I gotta go. I will see you later. Thanks everybody for watching and hanging out.